north of downtown Corpus Christi. We're closer than you think. This is your six sports report. Hey everyone, I'm Larissa Liska at the American Bank Center for a Texas A&M Corpus Christi basketball doubleheader. The last games of the regular season, a Southland Conference duel against the University of Incarnate Word. The men with a shot at history, Jim Shaw was one win away from breaking the best regular season record of a first year head coach. Steve Lutz had 20. Cardinals down by three. Sky Wicks making some space, says sky's the limit, splashes the triple, and the game is tied at 13 all. The Islanders want to see it rain near the coast. Dane Prime drains a contested three pointer. Coach Shaw loves it. Corpus Christi is up 18 to 13. Another three. This time it's Gary Clark. A few buckets later, he scores from downtown again. Islanders lead 26 to 15. Cardinals try again, but Marion Humphrey steals the rock, takes a cross court pass, give it right back, and the layup is good. And the Islanders win 71 to 52. The men earned a two round bye in the upcoming conference tournament, going straight to the semifinals. We have a, a lot of good players, a number of really, really good players that are talented, that uh, love each other. Not only are they smart IQ basketball wise off the court, but they're just good people and they, they came together and, and really grew as a team over the uh, over the course of a season. The women also hosted UIW in Rockport Fulton grad Kaylee Hal. But with more on the line, an Islanders victory secures the number two tournament seed. Cardinals claw ahead early. Ramey McCrary hits the mid-range jumper. Cardinals lead 10 to 6. But the Islanders answer quickly. Defensive steal by Timberland Criswell. She delivers to Maria Guado weaves in the paint and lays it in. Corpus Christi is up by two. Then Nabiwa McGill showcases her deep threat. Wide open three hits Silk. Islanders are up 15 to 10. Corpus Christi fans want to see another one, but this time her shot is short. But Alicia Westbrook is there for the put back. Her last home game at Texas a and Corpus Christi. And the Islanders win 65 to 43. A critical victory that also earned the women a two-round tournament by. I thought tonight we played really good defense. I thought we uh, did a really good job of communicating and staying uh, with, between them and the basket. For us to have the opportunity to win by double digits, we're, we're very happy with that. We started a little bit like uh, with our defense, but then we came back really well and like we cranked it up and I think like that really helped us a lot. So we just got to keep building on our defense, I think. We wait for you in Louisiana and thank you for supporting us. <laughs> The Southland Conference Tournament begins Sunday in Lake Charles, Louisiana. The Islanders tip off the men's semifinals on Tuesday and the women's semifinals on Wednesday. I'm Marissa Liska, Chris Six Sports.